I can also confirm that 137 people are in hospital. That's an increase of 14 from yesterday. 15 people are in intensive care. I reported 14 yesterday, but that was later revised upwards to 16. So today's figure of 15 is actually one fewer than yesterday. Public Health Scotland have also published figures this morning showing that in the week ending the 26th of September, uh, there were a total of 94 COVID admissions to hospital, uh, and that is up from 58 in the previous week. This is a 60% increase in hospital admissions from one week uh, to the next, and it should remind us of how wrong it is to assume that because the recent rise in cases has been driven by the younger population, it is nothing to worry about. That is, in my view, dangerous complacency that we simply cannot afford right now. And to underline that point, I deeply regret to say that seven additional deaths have been registered of people who first tested positive for COVID during the previous 28 days. And the total number of deaths under that measure is now 2,519. That figure of seven deaths is the highest I have had to report at one of these briefings since the 17th of June. It is therefore a very sharp reminder of the fact that COVID is an extremely dangerous virus as well as a highly infectious one. 